welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my March update for Throwback 30. This is a project that I created to kind of get a little taste of all the projects that I have not been able to do because I just can't do all the projects all the time. This is going to be a recurring project so when this is done in May there will be a new version of Throwback 30 starting the day that this one ends and there will be a little mix up. There's going to be um, some of the recurring ones that we do year after year. Plus there's going to be um, other projects that have been done in the last year in the Fantastic Ladies groups added in. And yeah, it's just, it's going to keep evolving. Every time there's new projects coming up, there's going to be new projects added to the Throwback 30. Just, you know, we can all get a little taste of everything without having to do the whole thing. If you're wondering what is going on with my voice, I am hoping it's allergies right now. <clears throat> I woke up this morning and I felt a little scratchy and it is allergy season for me. I have my water here and I, I'm hoping all it is is allergies. <clears throat> my, um, my kids have been to school all week, so you never know if they picked up the funk or something worse. We just won't know. We're gonna, we're gonna play this one out. We're gonna be positive that Everything's going to be okay, and uh, um, I'm just going to keep going. So let me get a sip of water, and then we will get on to this. As of the last update, I had 27 of the 30 done, and that is still where I'm standing with the 27 of 30. <clears throat> Pardon me. Um, for, let's see, Fire and Ice, I have this Retzelini Advanced Hydration Face Wash. Um, Fire and Ice was based off of a Robert Frost poem. This um, original project was created by Rebecca. And um, Fire products were red, orange, yellow. Ice products were white, gray, silver, or blue. And um, we had to pick products based on those colors, whether they were fire or ice. This one is a little bit of both. I've got like the ice up here and I've got some fire down here and I've got some progress. I was at this blue line right here last time and now I'm at this blue line. A little bit more progress this time, this past month than previously because I had been working on some other face washes in conjunction with this one. This is the only one that I am working on right now. So hopefully I will have an even better progress line for you next month. I'm going to guess this is probably going to take me um, a month and a half-ish, hopefully no more than two months, and then we can call this one done because this project is done in May, so <clears throat> we will see how that works out. For Justice League, I chose the Flash, and his color was red, so I chose this Essence Lash Princess Volume Mascara because it's got his red plus the black. I mean, it's very flash colors. Um, obviously, there's no way to actually monitor progress on this one, <clears throat> but um, I've been using it every day for, I want to say, a month and a half, maybe two months now, and... Um, it definitely should be done by May. I average three to three and a half months on a, a mascara, like a full-size mascara. Um, I don't generally go by the three-month rule and you throw it out. I use it until it's, you know, not working anymore. But I just, I happen to average three to three and a half months. So I am expecting this to be done completely by the May 16th finale. So I'm not too worried about that one. And I'm not worried at all about this face wash. <clears throat> this next one, on the other hand, I'm not sure about. This is for Cupid's Bow, um, which was a Valentine's themed, basically 14 by February 14th, but we um, did it as a Valentine's theme. So I chose the Bare Minerals Rose Gossamer. This is empty, but it's not done. So even though there's nothing in here, um, if you watched one of my pressing videos, I pressed it into this e.l.f. little compact. So this is what it looks like. And I mean, it's got some dip in it, but that was partially from when I pressed it. I just don't know how long this is gonna take. I am going to prioritize this, but um, you just never know. One thing about this that um, may be in my favor is it's not very pigmented. 
So, um, <clears throat> yeah, I think it could be used as like a highlight, a blush topper, and I think I'm going to need to build it up a little bit. It's just, it doesn't have a lot of oomph, which is why I wanted to press it in the first place, but it's still not, um, still not where I would like a highlighter to be. That is it right there. You can barely see it. Not a ton of shimmer or anything on it. It's, I'm not in love with it. And I've got a lot of gossamers in my collection. They were um, gifted to me over the years. But um, I'm just going to keep working on it. That's all I can do. And um, <clears throat> we will see how it goes. I, I don't know if I'll have PN by next month. I, ideally, if I'm going to finish it by May 16th, I would need to have PN on it by the next update, but <clears throat> you never know. And if I don't finish it, then it'll get rolled into something else at some point because I would like to have that done this year. But, you know, if I only finish 29 out of 30, I am not going to be heartbroken over it because, you know, 29 products done and out of my collection, that ain't too shabby. So that is everything for this update. If you are doing Throwback 30, the 2019 version, let me know how you're doing in the comments. And um, if you haven't joined in, let me know if you are going to consider joining for the 2020 version because it will be coming up and um, I will be posting that in the group very soon. And there's gonna be another project that needs to get posted in the group soon. I just, life has been crazy. So um, it is coming up. We have an, an April 15th project coming up that needs to get posted. So. Be on the lookout for that, and I think that is everything for this update. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until I see you on my next video, have a beautiful day.